today a phenomenal, fantastic, absolutely delicious sweetbread muffin recipe. Let's go ahead and get started. I've got two cups of flour, one cup of granulated sugar, two and a quarter teaspoons of baking powder, one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of cinnamon, and a half a teaspoon of nutmeg, ground nutmeg, or freshly grated nutmeg. I've also got one cup of coconut and three quarter cup of raisins. We are also going to be needing some evaporated milk. I have a half a cup of evaporated milk and I've also got one, I got one of these little, uh, three it's six ounces or three quarter cup yogurt. This is French vanilla and it is going to be perfection in this recipe. We're also going to need one egg that I've just beaten up real quick and some vanilla extract or mixed essence and the zest of an orange. So all I'm going to do is mix together my dry ingredients. Now if you follow, if you've seen my pound cake recipe, my pound sponge cake recipe, you know that I use... Um, this French vanilla yogurt in it. So I figured, you know what, hey, I want to see how it would work in my sweet bread. Because it's like two of my favorite things combined. Pound cake and sweet bread. And it is phenomenal. I couldn't stop I just had to stop myself. We're also going to be needing some melted butter. One stick or a half a cup of melted butter. And, which I seem to somehow forget. So I'm going to go ahead and add my butter, which is cooled, my evaporated milk, my egg, and my mixed essence. And I'm also going to add in my yogurt, all of my wet ingredients together in a bowl and mix that real well. And then I'm going to also, I'm just pretty much combining all of these things together. My oven is preheated to 350 degrees. And I tell you, this recipe is amazing. It is perfection. It is so delicious. It is moist. It is like Oh my goodness, I don't even know. So, and so I'm just going to add in my wet to my dry. And of course, can't forget the zest of the orange. I'm using about a half of the zest of the orange. I don't want to take away from the coconut flavor or anything like that. And I'm going to get my muffin tin. And I'm going to spray it with nonstick cooking spray and then fill it about three quarters of the way full. I don't want it to fill too much, but it can hold a little bit. You just want to give it a little bit of room to rise up because it will be doing that. And these are going to bake for about 25 to 35 minutes, about 30 minutes or so. And what we're going to do is about... Five minutes before it's done, take it out of the oven, sprinkle a little bit of granulated sugar on top, and then put it back in the oven for another five minutes. Now, in a sweet bread recipe, it takes like an hour and sometimes an hour and 30 minutes to bake. These don't do that. No, no. These take about 30 minutes. It's perfect. It's perfect to grab one and go. You don't have to cut a slice of one, put it on a napkin, no crumbs falling, falling all over the place. They are fantastic. Just grab one with your cup of coffee and go. And it is so perfect. I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.